Julian went to the bookstore traveling four miles per hour and returned home traveling ten miles per hour. If the total trip took seven hours, how long did Julian travel at each speed? So I'm going to draw a table with three, no, four rows and four columns. Um, and distance equals rate times time, so I'm going to say rate times time is equal to distance. All right, so there's the, um, the trip to and then the return is what we're comparing. So he was traveling to the bookstore four miles per hour, and um, his return It's 10 miles per hour. The total trip took seven hours, so that's total time. Call this total. And uh, we don't know anything about his distance. Um, but we do know that the distance to and, and from would be the same. So I'm just going to write same here. All right, so we don't know how long it took him to get to the bookstore, so we're just going to call it T. But we do know however long it was, say it was two hours, and if the total trip was seven hours, then that means the return trip took five hours, so you're subtracting. Um, so we don't know how long it was, so we're just going to do uh, seven minus T there. So again, you know, say it took him four hours to get to the bookstore. Um, if the total was seven, then that means it took him three hours to get back. So that's probably the most difficult part is just figuring that out. Um, so you're just subtracting whatever time it took him to get to uh, from the total, and that gives you the return time. All right, so that gives us um, distances. Four times t is 4t. And 10 times 7 minus t is his distance for the return. And those are the same, so what we're going to do is we're going to set them equal to each other. So we're going to get 4t equals 10 times 7 minus t. And then we're going to distribute, so we get 4t equals 70 minus 10t. I'm going to add that 10t over to the other side to get all our t's together. And I get 14t equals 70, and we divide both sides by 14, and I believe that 70 divided by 14 is 5. So it took him 5 hours at 4 miles per hour, and um, if we subtract that from 7, it would be 2 hours at the 10 miles per hour.